I heard God just tell me, just trust me. Just trust me. And it was in a moment that was terrifying. That was dangerous. And literally, it was an irresistible pull to just trust him. And I did. And it literally changed my life immediately. Immediately. Um, I just felt so free immediately in that moment of just listening to him and just, just giving him the control. And... From there, it got really bad and it got really scary and I lost all my friends and people noticed that I was different right off the bat and I literally lost everybody um, very quickly. And I continued to struggle and I continued to, to try to figure out what the heck it meant that I just committed myself to, but I, again, had nobody to really help me with that. And, and eventually I got to the point where I just realized, I just I just felt God just tell me, you know, um, it had been put heavy on my heart that it just felt like when you become a Christian, when you, when you, when you choose to have faith, you just are set out there and you're, and you're like, okay, then I'll just go off and just do what a Christian's supposed to do. And it's like, but I had no direction. I had nothing. I didn't even really own a Bible. I had a Bible, but it was a translation that's really confusing. And, and I really... I didn't, I, I didn't have any body to help me, and um, so I stumbled and I and I fell a lot. But after two years, um, I I went and I bought my first Bible, and I clung to it, and I dove in deep, man. And uh, that was the next point that just really changed everything for me. Um, fast forward two more years. Um, you know, I can tell you exactly what it was. <laughs> when I was 16, I was baptized. And I did not have a clue what the heck that meant. But they gave me this NRSV. A Wesley Study Bible. And I tell you what, I tried. I tried. Here's some original notes. I tried. And boy, I tell you, it was confusing. It was so confusing. <laughs> but, fast forward. Two years into owning this Bible little ESV. <sighs> Two years into owning this, I studied so hard. I read it. I didn't understand most of what I was reading, but I tell you what, I read Job, and I read the Peters. And Philippians, actually, as well. And those absolutely were the turning point for me. My, uh, my notes and my highlights. First Peter was massive life changing for me. Job was massive life changing for me and they helped me to be set on the right path and helped me to learn more about who God was, who God is, um, what faith is, and it helped me understand that all the suffering that I had been through could be used to help me. And it started helping me to turn my bitterness into a heart of just service for God. And so two years into my faith of just stumbling and falling all over, I got my first Bible. Two years into having that Bible, God called me to make massive life changes um, massive life changes. Uh, he called me to quit my job and become a stay-at-home mom. And let me tell you, that was tough. But I knew without question God was calling me to do it. And I had to obey. Had to obey. And so I did. It was just an irresistible call. Irresistible. I tell you what. Oh, my gosh. And... Uh, 
after a few months of being a stay-at-home mom and getting into a slump, I felt God, <laughs> thanks to the help of my family as well, telling me to get it together. Um, God called me to start this community. And it started out as me streaming in the wrong category on Twitch, evolved into an ESO guild, Christian guild. And from there, it just, for months, I tell you what, for months, it was me by myself on Twitch. Um, just, just trying to study the Bible there and share the word of God in the only way that I knew how at the time. And, and, um, then I found Super Shadow and that introduced me to GMA and a plethora of, of other Christian content creators, Christian gaming communities. And it was just incredible. And... Now here we are two years later. After that, we are about to have our two year anniversary of our community in just over a month. And I am so, yes, thank you for that shout out for Super Shadow. He's amazing. I encourage everybody to go give him a follow. Um, this has been an incredible ride. Has been an absolutely incredible ride. Um, 